It is right there on her Facebook page. Newly elected Clackamas County Chair-elect Tootie Smith says she will celebrate Thanksgiving with as many family and friends as she can. The Republican politician's comment made the Today Show Tuesday morning in a story about new restrictions. Freezes, which some have openly defied. One local Oregon commissioner posting, My family will celebrate Thanksgiving with as many family and friends as I can find. Governor Brown is wrong to order otherwise. That declaration leveled against a portrait of pain. We tried to reach Smith to talk about the post today, but we haven't heard back. However, another Clackamas County Commissioner did respond to Smith's plan to defy and gather. I would say that sending a message of having large gatherings is very, very dangerous because we know the science of this virus is that it spreads in social gatherings. That is where the spread is happening. Also in Clackamas County, a naturopathic doctor in Canby has a billboard up saying cloth masks don't stop viruses. On the Canby Clinic's website, Dr. Erin Walker lays out her rationale. It's clear she's not a big fan of face coverings. What do you recommend? What type of mask do you recommend as an alternative cloth mask? Then? Or do you? So that's another great question. I think, again, it's very important for people to be aware of the limitations of masking and that it masking doesn't stop viruses. But the vast majority of medical and public health professionals disagree. Tri-County Health Officer Dr. Jennifer Vines says the science supports wearing well-designed cloth masks or other suitable and safe face coverings. As for the billboard... I have some concerns about how people uh, might interpret that sign and, and actions they may take um, thinking, um, thinking that Face coverings are actually not helpful when, in fact, it's very clear that they are. Clackamas County is a diverse place. There are a variety of opinions, but the science is the same here as it is anywhere. That masks, social distancing in small groups slow the spread and save lives. Commissioner Fisher is going with that. I'm so grateful that there are people that I love in my life, and I'm so grateful that I can do my part in helping to keep everyone safe. We are in a crisis point in our community. Tim Gordon, KGW News.